Hello and welcome to Tech Deals. Today I'm going to be showing you how to set up a new hard drive in Windows. This is the Acer Aspire E15 laptop computer. I've previously reviewed this computer, link in the description below. Why are we here? Because another video linked below shows the installation of a new hard drive in this laptop. There is a solid state drive built into this machine. I added an additional hard drive to it, but it is not set up in Windows. That's what we're here for. So if we come down, we're in Windows right now, if we open up Windows File Explorer and we click on this PC, you will see disk, uh, local disk C is there with 213 gigabytes free out of 237. The D drive is the DVD writer, which this machine has, but there's no E drive. Where's the hard drive? We installed a two terabyte drive. Not to worry, I'm gonna show you how to do that. First of all, we're gonna come down to the start menu and then we're going to type in computer management. And you actually don't have to type the whole thing and it comes up. We'll press enter to open computer management. I will maximize this. Oops. Maximize this. If you look on the left hand side of the screen, system tools, storage and services and application, click on disk management under storage. When disk management comes up, you will see there are two drives detected. Well, three if you count the, the DVD drive. The first one is the basic two terabyte drive, which currently says unallocated with a big black bar across the screen. The one right below that shows the solid state drive. The blue indicates there are partitions. It's currently set up. And you can even see the, the uh, C drive letter there, which is your main um, boot drive that has Windows and your programs on it. All you have to do to set up a hard drive in Windows is to right click on the big black bar that says unallocated, choose new simple volume, click next to the wizard that comes up, leave it default because it will uh, by default take the entire amount of storage. It will assign a drive letter. Now you can click the down arrow here and pick any of these letters you want. I'm gonna go ahead and leave it at E, but you could pick a different letter if you wanted to. We'll hit next. Leave it at format this volume because without that you won't actually have it set up. You won't have a drive letter. Under volume label, you can change this if you want. I'm going to change it to data just because that's where I'm going to store my data, my files, my documents, my music, my videos, that sort of thing. I'm going to leave everything else the same. Hit next. Here's the settings. Hit finish. This only takes a few seconds. Formatting. Daddy E is set up. If we close computer management, and you look in File Manager, boom, you've got your Data E drive listed right there. We can click on it. Now it's empty because there's nothing on it, but you could certainly copy files to it. When you install programs or if you download files and you want them to go to the hard drive instead of the solid state drive, you just need to go to the E drive in this case, unless you chose a different letter, as opposed to the C drive. This way you've got plenty of room to install large games or download movies or music or other files without taking up your solid state drive. Was this helpful? Click like, was it not? Don't. Remember to subscribe to my channel. It's the big red button down there. That'll get you future notifications to how-to guides, unboxings, performance reviews, and all kinds of fun tech-related stuff. Questions, comments, thoughts, feedback, suggestions, that goes in the video description below. Let me know what you think. Was this too long, too short, too simple, too complex? Um, I am all ears as to your opinions of this video. As always, if you like any of my videos, if you want to support my channel, if you like these kind of guides, use the links in the video description below. Those will support me and help me out so I can keep making you future videos. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time.